Lastly, here on the Don't Tell Mama Sports Podcast, thanks for sticking with us. Great episode this week, fellas. Yes. But we've been ending here the last few weeks with a new special topic called Showtime with Shohei. We got it. We got to give respect to Sho- Shohei Otani here. And, yes. And designate two, three minutes to him every week. Currently at the MLB All Star break, the midway point of the season. He has scored 63 runs, which is ninth, 103 hits, which is eighth. He has 32 home runs, 32, let me say that again, 32 home runs, which is first by three. He's got the, he's got Matt Olson by three. He's got 71 ribbies, which is third. He's batting a career high 302. Mm-hmm. He's got a career high on base percentage of 387. He has a career high, and he also leads the league in slugging percentage and OPS. Leads the league in career high, slugging percentage slugging percentage and OPS. Also leads the league with 226 total bases. Mm. Now, on the mound, he's got a 3.32 ERA with 132 strikeouts in 100.1 innings. Those 132 strikeouts are good for fourth in baseball while he also leads the league with six hits per nine. Max, we talked about him last week being selected as both a DH and a pitcher for the All-Star game. Mm-hmm. We saw we saw him Tuesday night. He didn't pitch. He batted twice with a walk and a strikeout. Mm-hmm. But, Max, I just read off a couple career-high numbers, a couple numbers that are leading baseball. Yeah. What's your opinion on that? A what an incredible halftime for for Shohei Otani, a career year again, looking like MVP and potentially a Cy Young. Uh, we talked about this last week. This guy is the best player in baseball, obviously. But you know what else I just love about the guy is it looks like he's just having fun out there, isn't it? Isn't it just so enjoyable when you see a player that's so good at the game? That it's just fun for him now. It's not just business. He he's out there and like with a smile, like he's mm-hmm. like ah, I got another day. Another day out here on the pitch. You know, like, I can't wait. Can't wait to throw the ball. Uh, you know, yeah, when I was watching the All Star game, he slid into second base and like just the smile he had and uh, the players around him that were you know coming up and patting him on the back and stuff. You know, it's like uh, I just love the you know the fun environment that he brings to the game. So Shohei, you know, keep it up, man. Keep it up. There's one question I have do I do have for you, Cobrizi. The trade deadline is coming up. I know it's, it might be might be a little soon to talk about this. We'll talk about this a little bit more detailed when the trade deadline does officially come here. But do you think Shohei is staying with the Angels? I really hope so, Max. Mm-hmm. Um, right now, they are five games back of the yep. third wild card. Okay, five games back of the playoffs. Now that's that's reachable. Yeah, oh yeah, and. I don't know why you would trade your best player when uh, when the playoffs are reachable. I'd love for him to stay in Anaheim. Anaheim's a cool city, and he. I'd love for him to stay there. That I, I'm hearing. I'm hearing. Obviously, the Yankees are going to be involved, and you know all the big name teams. Yeah, Dodgers. I hear, I keep hearing the Dodgers over here in L.A. And this is because he is a free agent this summer or yep. this winter, so he uh, he's going to be available and. I hope the Angels give him all the money in the world. I'm just hearing just from around here in L.A. Uh, uh, it's just just some rumors that the Angels are not going to have enough money to pay for what he's worth. You know, fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, I, I said we said it before that Angels, if you're smart, trade away everyone else other than Shohei, because <laughs> this is the guy that not only is going to win you baseball games, but if you were thinking of a business side of, of things, he is going to build your organization by bringing in profit because everyone wants to watch Shohei Otani. Everybody wants to watch Shohei. You're putting butts in the seats when Shohei yes. comes to town. Yes. So uh, Shohei, it doesn't accept. It, it doesn't take the place of what you're doing. You're, you're you're you are so good that it's not that the angels don't want you, man. It's not that they just don't want you. It's this that there's. There's going to be a point where you're going to realize that, oh, well, you know, I can go to a different city and make more money. And I have a feeling that he's going to take it. Why wouldn't you? 
Maybe he feels some type of uh, loyalty to Anaheim and wants to take a rip. less take less money. Take less money. Hey, stay, I stay I like with the humble boy Trout. I like if he's humble. That'd, that'd be that'd be cool. But you know, it's Shohei Otani, best player in baseball in the world.